Here is our wonderful hostess, the Grace Life DIY Home Decor. And our second hostess, Amethyst Avengers. Oh my gosh, they're both such wonderful creators. Please go over and check them out. And make sure you check out the playlist also. We had a lot of great creators joining in today. Well, this was fast and easy. This was just a cute little display I already had. I'm going to have to add a little more to it. It looks a little sad. But you know, Grandma, I always have something. Let's go shop that house and start looking. Also, I also have these. So far, we're at a zero cost. You think we can put this tablescape together for free? I think we can. We just need to start shopping the house. Okay, let Grandma go shopping. We'll see what we can find. Well, as you see, we got the centerpiece a little fuller and a little touch of fall and a little touch of Christmas mixed all in the same tablescape centerpiece. I thought it turned out pretty good. I think I'm still going to go and get some little nuts from the house and throw them in and some seed pods. But I think that's all my centerpiece needs. Well, let me go shopping and you better hurry up. The rain's coming any minute. Well, I'm done. I'm happy with how it looks now. Just adding a few little extra things did add that little extra touch. Have some nuts and seed pods in here now. I have more of these, but I keep saying I don't know where I put them. Can't find them. And I have some more seed pods over here. I thought it turned out pretty good. It's pretty full now. No bare places in my centerpiece. Oh my gosh. You can tell one thing I do love. I love a good centerpiece. And that's almost all on the tray except for the little flowers. And you see I have my little fall leaves back here. And they have some little nuts connected to them too. Oh my gosh. And of course, we have our wonderful butterfly. And the same on this side, except a different seed pod here at the bottom. Very happy. This so far is 100% free. Everything here I've had for quite some time. I'm really loving how it's turning out. Well, you know, I just noticed this isn't as far out as this side here. Let me fix that. Thank goodness I was filming this for I could see it was off. It's looking a lot better now. Okay, now let's go to our next thing we're going to do for this tablescape. And you know, we gotta hurry up. We got the rain coming. Yay, we made it before the rains came. You can hear the birds. They are so excited that Grandma made it. They didn't think I would either, but we did. And here it is, our fall tablescape for two. Out on the patio, and the best part of all, free, free, free. I always love that word, free. Everything here I've had for a long time. And I'm going to share something else that I haven't had out in a long time. But it's not new, I've had it a long time my pumpkin gather pumpkin pillows. I have one for each chair because I've always done tablescapes for two. I was so happy to have I found them to put out here. This place setting, uh, everything here I've had for quite some time and uh, not quite sure where everything came from. The charger came from uh, Hobby Lobby. The plate here is from Dollar Tree, the white one with the gold trim on it, and you can find some really nice things at Dollar Tree, but this isn't new. I think they were bought last year or the year before last, so I only paid a dollar for them. This is a plate that I got from one of the little stores in uh, Redlands where I work. The silverware and the napkins came from um, Home Goods, and they both I've had for some time. We've talked about the glasses. The glasses are probably 20. 
25. They might be 30 years old. You know, when you get to a certain age, you just sort of forget. But I've had them a while. Let's put it that way. So I think it turned out pretty good. Now, I know my tablescapes are a little bit on the simple side compared to what most of you do. But I am not, I don't do big fancy displays, as you all know. I do tablescapes for two, and I do tablescapes that anyone can do. Anyone. I started doing tablescapes about three, about three years ago. And if you go back and look at the beginning tablescapes, they were pretty pitiful looking. I have improved a lot. And I'm sure in the next two or three years, I will still improve even more. But we will still be keeping them on the simple side. Because I want to share with people that anyone can do a tablescape that will look really pretty out in the garden or in the house. You don't need to spend a ton of money. Shop your house like I did. And I know it looks like there's a lot here. And there is. But this has all been bought over a long period of time. None of this stuff is really new. Some of it I've had for years. But shop that house. You'll be amazed at what you can do. And this is a fall tablescape. And to remind us that we're heading into Thanksgiving time. And as you can see, we have Happy Harvest here. And our little black crow. Oh, listen, the birds are singing with joy. They're so happy I finished this tablescape before the rains came. And you know, I always put my butterflies somewhere in everything I do. They bring me so much joy. So, you can join in anytime you want. This is goes up every Tuesday. You can do simple displays like me. Do not feel like, oh, I don't have anything to share. Yeah, you do. You have lots to share. You just don't know it. You'd be amazed what you can find in your home if you just go shopping. Look what I did. I went and filled this whole table up with all kinds of little treasures. And if you keep coming back, you're going to find more amazing things I can make a centerpiece out of. What I can do a tablescape out of. I reuse, repurpose. You can use something ten times in a row and just change your centerpiece, a napkin, some little thing on this table or rearrange it a different way and it'll look different. Like I put the pillows out today. Normally I don't put pillows out. But this, I felt like it was a special tablescape we should do something special for. So, hugs and kisses to all of you that came and watched. And please, if you aren't already joining in every Tuesday, think about it. You don't have to do it every Tuesday. You can do it once in a while or all the time. We just love having you here with us. And if you just want to come over and skip, be inspired, go ahead. Check that playlist. You'll see tablescapes like mine that are simple and pretty. And you'll see some beautiful, beautiful tablescapes for entertaining and doing something special. You'll always be inspired on Tablescape Tuesday. Well, see you next Tuesday. Hope you come back and see what Grandma does. We have something special coming up next week. Oh no, the sprinkles are coming. I got to clean my table off in a hurry. Let's run and get it picked up. <laughs>